Tonight we shine our spotlight on a Newport News shipyard retiree, and it was a current shipyard employee, Aaron Pritchett, who brought this retiree to my attention. Aaron sent me an email telling me about Glenn Norcutt, who had been with the shipyard for nearly 50 years. Aaron says nearly every day on his way to the shipyard, he sees Norcutt out making a difference, as we see in tonight's Everyday Hero Award. I always find trash in the park. Glenn Norcutt retired over a year ago, but the former Newport News shipyard employee is not sitting still. How did this start? Well, I was just, when I retired, I started walking and just to get my exercise in, and, and I just didn't, just couldn't stand to see all the trash laying on the yards and side the road. You can find the 47-year veteran of the shipyard not far from his old job, regularly picking up trash in the Huntington Heights community along Warwick Boulevard. You have any sense of how much trash you've picked up? Uh, well, it, it normally averages anywhere from uh, four to five bags, little grocery bags every day. So the neighbors here, they, they, they appreciate what you're doing. Oh, yeah. Uh, the neighbors, a lot of them have come out and uh, thanked me for doing it and said they're glad I'm doing it. So, you know, I, I do two and a half miles at least every day. So I found credit cards, found credit three, card? found three credit cards, about eight gift cards, so two, what do you, two driver's license. What, now, do you, what do you do with the driver's license and the credit card? If I can find the people, I, care, I give it back. Found two cell phones. One of them was a shipyard guy's cell phone, and it, it worked, and his wife called the phone, so I answered it, told her where I lived, so she, he came by that afternoon, picked his phone up. What's the reaction of the people when you call them up and say, hey, I have your driver's license, and your credit card, or your cell phone? Yeah, because the guy that, that lost the, the credit cards, he said, man, he says, I figured that was all gone. For the people who see you out here regularly, yeah. what do you hope the message is to them? Well, I hope they'll quit throwing so much trash at the people on the road. Glenn, there's one other thing we want to do. Okay. And that is to present you with the News 3 Everyday Hero Award for what you're doing. Oh, okay. Well, thank you. And we have a community partner, Southern Bank. Southern Bank wants to give you a $300 Visa gift card. Whoa, all right. <laughs> well, thank you very much. He says he is <laughs> out there pretty much like every day, unless it's like really bad weather, he's out there in the mornings and sometimes he'll go back in the afternoon. He says it's a little, little disappointing that he'll go out there the next day and the trash will be back. Yeah, even the kids tell adults now not to litter. Yeah. But we could use Glenn in every neighborhood here in Hampton Roads. You know, it's nice that people care so much about their environment. And he says, people, it up. he says people are so surprised when he calls them and says, hey, I got your wallet, I got your credit card, I got <laughs> hey, your cell phone. You gave him a gift card he can actually keep. Yes, yes, that's right. <laughs> Hey, so if you know someone making a difference in our community, nominate them for an Everyday Hero Award at WTKR.com.